Hello everyone, my name is Winged Supernova, and welcome back to Metroid Dread. In the last episode, we obtained the storm missile stuff from beating Eskew over here, I believe that's what we did. Um, and in this episode, we have to make our way back. We went into, uh, we, we destroyed this storm missile box, and then we went to the save station, and we have to go back through the Emmy area with the underwater Emmy, unfortunately. And after that, we have to make our way all the way back here to grab this item sphere that we saw that was blocked by this storm missile box. So let's begin our trek back in that direction. We also have this storm missile box over here, but I think it's probably blocked on this side. So we'll probably have to make our way through this direction in order to even get there um but yeah uh we will see so let's start our little journey back this direction oh, you son of a bitch all right and there we go let's see we're gonna go down here does still hit you. Huh. So it really just acts as a power bomb. It automatically knows where I am. That's so dumb, dude. Alright, get the fuck out of my way. I can't believe I made that. Super good. I'm down here. Alright, we got you. Give me that red X. Oh man. So I can't go that way yet. I need the I need the suit. Oh. Come down here. Oh, come on. No, not dealing with you again. Oof. Well, that was interesting. Uh, trying to use the storm missile. Nice. So that's how we do that. One, two, three, four, five on that one. Oh, I gotta face two of you assholes. the input on my second jump there. No, fuck, dude. I saw it coming. I don't think there's a way to counter that. 
I can't like, well, I haven't tried, but I can't, I don't think I can just parry it or anything like that. God, this sucks. I hate these fights. Oh, fuck you, dude. Does that even hit? God, dude, he fucking destroyed me. Having to fight two of these is gonna be definitely a, definitely a struggle for me. And I thought I was supercharged, but apparently not because this stuff doesn't, doesn't do much. I gotta remember that I have this dash ability as well. Oh, God. How? How? That doesn't even hit him. So... Okay. Charge shots hit, but... Oh. Dude. Those fucking- that move is so dumb, I don't know what I can do to avoid it. Like, I'm gonna try, if he charges at me, I'm gonna try doing the Aeon dash. And if I can dash through him, then we know what the answer is, but otherwise, I got no fucking clue. Because they do that move randomly, right? It's just a- it's just a chance of it happening. Okay. being safe as fuck right now. Oh, what the fuck, dude. You know, having to fight one of you is just a chore automatically. Ugh. And then, then the second one comes in, and they, it feels like they know, right? It feels like they know that just one shot from these assholes hurts you. Oh god. I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out how to press 10 buttons 10 buttons at once because it feels like that's what I need to do in order to even hit these guys. I'm going to I'm going to go back to just shooting missiles, I think. And as soon as I say that, I charge up a charge shot. Oh god, dude. They they move so quick. It's so ridiculous. I'm just trying to shoot, not move, and it won't let me. God, my movement is so slow. Like, really? I should honestly just... What? Oh, okay. I think the... I was like, how did I get hit there? And then I realized, oh yeah, the other guy was shooting beams at me. Yeah, this is gonna be... This is gonna be the entire episode, I think. Just me f trying to fucking kill these guys. I don't know how I killed one on my first try, and then, like, the second one... I don't know. It's very weird. How? How'd that hit me? I don't get it. 
Oh. God. Dude, how the fuck do I dodge one person's, like, ranged attack and then have to deal with the other ones? Bullshit. And then he can just fall down from that ledge and run into me and do, like, a whole health bar worth of damage as well. This game is brutal. I wish there were an easy mode setting, to be quite honest, because I don't feel like I accomplish much when I just die a million times. I'm not that type of gamer, to be quite honest. Whenever I just die a million times, it doesn't feel good. It just feels like bad game design. Even though I know it's just being difficult for the sake of being difficult. Oh god, let me jump up. I don't want to grab the ledge. Can you not do that attack? Dude! He did that attack three fucking times in a row! That's so dumb! Can you not do the attack that's unblockable? And of course he decides to do that attack. When I'm about to get shot from the other direction, and I can't parry it, because I'm dead. I don't get it, man. I don't I don't get the RNG aspect of this. And I don't understand why I can't shoot ice missiles faster. I wish I could shoot them like super fast, but I can't. Ugh god, that attack is so dumb. Ugh. Can you not? Fucking Christ, dude. This is so dumb. Ugh. Fuck, dude. It's like, I understand that I'm about to be trapped right there, so I try and jump and use my dash, but I don't get enough height from the first jump to dash onto the ledge. And I can't dash in any direction. It's only left or right, I believe. Why? Oh, come on, dude. Let me jump up quicker. Can you not? Is he frozen? That was weird. How did that hit me? Dude, I don't get it. I dashed through it and I still got hit by it. So you cannot dash through things. You still get hit. Got it. So you have to jump and then dash in order to get over something like that. That's even more annoying. Because you have a period of tangibility on the down. Look at that. See? I have to do that in order to... I have to just zone them out. I have to run away a lot. That's how I do this. Ooh. Oh, I pressed the button too. Come on, man. Woo. I don't know how I got away from that. Get up here. Oh. Come on, dude.
how you're not dead. That was so quick. How? How did that hit me? Also, why the hell were they not dead? I had hit them with at least 15 missiles each, I would think. And they weren't dying. I don't... I don't get it. I have full missiles. But what are you supposed to do if you don't have full missiles? Just hit them with bullshit? Wow, he jumped up to fucking block me. I cannot believe that. Oh. So quick. Oh. I don't get it, dude. Oof. God, I need a parry. Oh, what? It hit the t it hit my toe as I was hanging onto the ledge. You know how uh, you know how you see. I don't know if you guys have seen Maximilian Dude out there, but he does uh, he does videos where he's like boss rage. Oh yeah, I fight the hardest bosses. Except he's actually good at video games, so that so it's entertaining because. You know that you, he can actually beat it, right? Uh, yeah, uh, that's not this. Oh my god, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? He knew exactly where I was going to be to fucking try and avoid that? Dude, this is so dumb. Why is my jump so limited? Oh, That's so dumb, dude. Ugh. Come on, dude. Why can't you do that? Ugh. Why can't I fucking realize? Why does my brain not process that that's going to be a counterable attack? I don't know why. I see the blue, right? Because when, when they're about to do the fucking unblockable attack, it lights up red. And when they're about to do the normal attack, it lights up blue. But for some reason, my brain goes, it's not the gold flash. But when the gold flash has happened, I'm already fucked. See, I wasn't even paying attention to him right there. See, I can tell that that's going to be bullshit. Come on, dude, let me jump. See, I can tell that that's going to be the bad one, right? Woo! I don't know how I got over him. Ugh, I'm not facing the right person. Ugh, I was trying to dash away there. And of course he does it right when I jump away. Oh, of course he doesn't jump down like he would usually do. Ugh, what the fuck, dude? I jumped over that. I swear to god I did. Oh, <laughs> that unblockable attack is so annoying because I don't always have 
the Aeon that I need, it takes a minute for it to come back and allow me to do the dash again. It's so fast paced that it's literally just gotta be muscle memory. I have to know everything that they're going to do, micromanage my muscle memory, and then punish accordingly, right? Just like what they say in Boss Rage. This game is brutal, by the way. I don't know if you guys have noticed. Because fighting one of these guys is a pain in the ass to begin with. Look at that. He doesn't give me any fucking time to react. And then I gotta worry about this bullshit from other... See, look at that! He doesn't give me any time to react. I'm trying to talk at the same time, too. Maybe I just need to shut up and get this done. Because this is this is literally taking me 20 minutes so far. So this is going to be a boss rage episode. And it's going to be like twice as long. Because I should beat the boss in probably about 5 minutes, right? That's how long it's supposed to take, right? That's how long the developers intended it to take. Every single time I miss one of those parries, I get pissed. God, I fucking hate that move, dude. Just do the normal attack. Ooh! I don't know how I missed that one. This fucking bitch. Look at this bitch! Die. Are you not dead? I parried him twice now. Look at this dumb shit. I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I really don't. Like, are the missiles not even hurting them, or...? I don't get it. I just don't get it. I don't know how I killed one earlier. Am I only supposed to be using charge shots on these guys? Like, how many missiles does it take to take one of those down? Because I feel like I've hit each one with at least 20. And 20 seems like a lot to take down one enemy. I'm going to be quite honest with you. It feels excessive. Look at this bullshit. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Just, just fucking kill me. Just, just kill me. Just kill me. Just, just straight up kill me. Thank you. Yeah, no, took too much damage at the beginning of that one. There was no way I was winning that anyway. 25 minutes. Just about, so far. Jesus fucking Christ. Can I just stand still? Can 
No. I don't think I can stand still and beat them, guys. I don't think that works. Some bosses use attacks that can be countered. Too bad they only give you about a quarter second notice. And then, as soon as you miss that quarter second window, you are dead. Or you're taking 100 damage, one of the two. It's very nice of them, isn't it? Yeah, of course. Of course he gives me the fast pattern. Ugh! See, the problem is, I'm pressing... I'm pressing 10 other buttons at the time when they're about to do that move, too. Ugh! And of course, as soon as I turn around, he starts to do it. Yeah. They always end up doing the counterable move at exactly the wrong point in time. Because I'm trying to do something else with my thumb. And they don't want me to. Not be there. I want to fight the orange one. Oh my god, dude. This is so dumb. Let me jump twice. I don't get it. Ugh. Can you give me the fucking right move? Jesus Christ. I think I was using micro-missiles before, and that was one of the reasons why I did so much damage. And I feel like that might be what they want me to do here, but how the fuck do you have enough ch time to charge micro-missiles on these guys? Like, do you have to kite them over to one side of the room and then run to the other and charge? Is that what you want me to do? Because that's a little ludicrous, don't you think? So this is how you're supposed to beat them, huh? Wow. So that's how you're supposed to beat them. Alright. Well. I suppose that's one way to do it. Let's save first. Now the episode can begin, because the boss rage is over. Oh, this isn't a save. Well, I guess it technically counts as one. Now we can progress, ladies and gentlemen. Only 29 minutes into the video, and we can finally move on. You see, it's stuff like this. It makes me wonder why I don't do edits for my bullshit.
And we got the space jump. Okay. We can now jump forever. When used underwater, Samus cannot gain more height after the first jump without the gravity suit. Okay, so the gravity suit is still a thing that we need to get. That we will probably get. Is it just... It's ZR. There we go. So you can really do it infinitely. Oh, come on, dude. So you have to do it at the at the exact right time. can we go? There's a missile plus tank with a bomb block and a speed booster block. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't know how to do a speed boost. Because those are pitfalls, right? Those are beam blocks. I'm not quite sure how you can... I mean, I know that you can get... You can get the speed that you need. But I don't know how in the hell you're able to... Boost upwards through that. Right? It doesn't feel like that's possible. I know that you can, like, I know that you can. I know that you can do that, right? How did I even get through that in the first top, first place? Cause like... It's not Aeon. I can't Aeon through it. I don't remember how I even got through that the first time, right? Seems weird to me. That's like the most annoying one of the X parasites, right? Hmm. There's also this.
me for my magic here. that jump all the way up there, right? Oh, you need to do multiple bombs. That's a little bit ridiculous. I'm not sure how that's possible, to be quite honest. going to have to go checking yeah I don't know how you're supposed to get past that enemy because it feels like you have to take that damage which is weird you know oops uh, I wanted this yeah show me oh there's stuff here I see Oh no, that's a pitfall block. Well, how the hell are you supposed to do that? Right? That makes no sense. Huh. If that's... You see, now I'm confused, and I have to go all the way back around, which sucks. But we'll figure this out. there point with me. What? How'd that not hit? Wow. It's really not it's really three bombs. 
I am so confused as to how. That doesn't work either. It's gotta be like... So that's like the way that I would see it working? Come on, dude. How? There's gotta be a different way to do this, right? See, I don't get it. So it's three bombs, but how the hell are you supposed to get all three, right? That's so weird. Come on, man. I'm gonna be here a while, I think. <laughs> so this is this is gonna be the episode of. Nova dying a lot to boss. Yeah, no. That's impossible. You can't start a bomb jump in midair there. You have to, like, somehow keep your height. It's, like, gonna be a very precise... Yeah, no, because now... Now that I get back up there, because I have to bomb jump my way back up, it's going to take too long, and the bomb block's coming back. Oh. I feel like maybe a power bomb would be the easiest way to do it, but I don't know if that destroys all bomb blocks in the area. Oh. Only I. If only I was able to place more at. I gotta place like two. Ugh. There wasn't enough of one. Come on. Come on, dude. I don't know how I got two the last time. It feels so weird. If it were three missile blocks and then you had to space jump, I would understand it, but it's not. It's... You have to do... Three bomb jumps. Well, you have to get three bombs in a row there, which... Seems impossible to me. So, I think I'm gonna give up on that for now, because that seems dumb. That seems really dumb. Um, instead, we're gonna go... Not this way. We wanna go up. And see what's up in that area. If we can. Alright. Well, let's save again. I'm leaving all that in, just for your suffering, by the way. Of me trying to figure stuff out and not being able to, you know? Because everyone loves watching the streamer fail repeatedly. can't do anything over here. Because that's frozen. It's frozen! Oh, no. Can I get some missiles, please? Alright, I have five. Well, 
I haven't been this way yet. I can't go this way. It is impossible for me to go this way. I have to go back through the Emmy way in order to get there. And yes, it does allow me to go back the other way. So where do I need to go now? Alright, that's the question. That's a power bomb that I can't get yet. Probably. Hmm. I have the space jump. I don't want to go in there because it's frozen. It's freezy in there. I feel like I'll need the gravity suit for it. There's something hidden in that section. But it's not like I really care about that at the moment. Hmm. I feel like I've got to kill the Emmy now, right? That's like my, my choice. My only means of progression. But I don't know how to get in there. Because that place freezes me. That access is closed, which pretty much cuts off the rest of this. So the only way that I can really go anywhere is through that door, but the, I thought that door froze me. I don't know, maybe I'm, maybe I'm crazy. Let's go check. Maybe the way to progression was the friends that we made along the way. And by friends, I mean Samus doesn't have any except for... Except for a CO that she once had. Yeah, no, that's frozen. I can't go that way. So, what the hell? Is there like a path this direction? There is. But I don't know where it goes. Oh, that just leads back there. So what the hell? I feel like I have to go that way, but I don't have the ability to get the gravity suit at this point. Or at least I don't think I do. Maybe there's uh, something in Daron that I'm not that I don't know about. Because that's freeze area. That's freeze area. I can't really do much there, right? Hmm. Pretty confusing. Pretty confusing. I think I'm gonna look up uh, to figure out what the hell I need to do, right? And I'm gonna do that off camera, and I'm gonna end the episode here. Uh, because this episode has been a bit of a shit show. So I'm gonna look this up off camera, figure out what the hell I need to do. Um, and then... We will hopefully find some sort of progression. Because I feel like the only thing left is to have the gravity suit, and I don't have the gravity suit. And I don't see anywhere that I could potentially get it. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for me. Uh, for now. And I will see you guys when I have figured out what the hell I need to do. So, yeah. See you guys then.